only time I ever get really nervous is um, kind of right when it's all happening. It's, it's not really nerves, it's more just, ooh, excitement. It's like adrenaline, you know. So um, I don't feel nervous. I mean, it's coming together really good. We had like a really good theme this season. So I feel like it was just really a, a way more theatrical kind of show than we've ever done. Not really ever done, but it just has, we were really inspired last season by um, casting the girls. And we had so many hot black girls that we were like, we should do the whole show like you know what I mean so this season we really did that we, we ended up dividing the whole collection which is kind of a generally started like a 70s chic you know wide leg pant kind of vibe but we divided it into like six subcategories so they're always the same inspirations for me it's kind of like a ragamuffin girl a English girl a soldier girl um, we did a buffalo girl a little Malcolm McLaren nod um, we did the glamour girl and um, what was the other one the mods. The whole lamb brand and line is just supposed to be closed for me. So that's like, that's the whole fight. Like when, whenever we're going through and, you know, because certain designs come through and I'll be like, oh no, I would never wear that. Never wear that. And then other things, it's like, oh, I have the ideas. And it's like, can, you know, like literally what I'm wearing, like, could you make me a like plaid green? You know, it's like, come, you know, and so they make it. So it's all about it's supposed to be things that I would wear. I feel like almost naturally for you, the next thing should be a kid's line. Is that something that maybe is going to work? Um, it's about? bubbling in my brain, yeah. Is it? it is, yeah. I've been thinking about that a lot. And, I, you know, I have done lots of kids' clothes for Harajuku lovers in the past, but I, I would love to do it on a larger scale. So I'm you thinking about you it. you got two fashion trend-setting kids who get photographed. They're probably <laughs> the best dressed this every time. I mean, that must be a little bit of inspiration as well. I love dressing them. I always thought that. I was like, gosh, if I had a girl, you know, but actually dressing the boys is really fun. They have You can put some really cool stuff together for those guys. How do you kind of do it all, like the juggling with, you know, your music career, the fashion, the family? I mean, how does it work? How do you juggle it? Um, everything suffers like here and there. <laughs> Some days one thing will suffer more than the other, but um, at the, I don't know. It always seems to work out somehow. And I just right now I'm really lucky because the kids are, you know, the whole reason I started Lamb in the first place is that I thought, oh, you know, I want to be able to do something creative while I have a family and I can kind of be home and do it. And I just drag them over here. They're like they'll play in here while we're doing fittings and um, drag them to the nail salon and they <laughs> that kind of stuff. They come everywhere with me, so. Right now, I think they're on the horses in the in the park. That was what they were looking forward to doing, a carriage ride. But they'll be at the show tomorrow. And, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's really, really challenging. I'm not going to say that it's, like, not – it's it's not smooth or anything. But <laughs> but it, it works but out. I make it work. I make it work. Now, you have a lot of celeb followings, obviously, for this line. Is there anyone that you would love to dress or anyone that you want to collaborate with and, and, and see in your design? Um, I have an orange jumpsuit for Jennifer Lopez, so really? yeah, hopefully she'll she'll wear that. It's gonna be hot on her. We're putting it out there. Maybe <laughs> you can see it on Idol, right? Yeah, maybe maybe we'll see. And I also thought she would look hot in these. I was thinking about Jennifer a little bit. The colors, there's a lot of colors that she would look good in. Jen, I got you hooked up. <laughs> Another uh, celebrity that comes up when we think of you is, would you ever dress like a Lady Gaga? Because I sort of feel like your fashion is so edgy and out there. I mean, would that be something? Oh, well, I dress her like a Barbie doll. Um. <laughs> or see her in one of your, your creations. Yeah, I mean, I. that's the thing. I mean, it's all personal style. So you put it on, you own it. It's like you make it yours. I don't think I don't get that whole thing. It's like whatever is in you, you put it on, you can make it happen, whatever line it is, you know. But, um, yeah, I think she could pull off stuff here somehow. I think so. Yeah, she's a creative girl. She'd make it work.